to be honest, the paper was really insightful for me. It gave me a really a holistic picture of what well-being actually means and constitutes. Personally, from myself as, as a new head teacher as well, um, somebody who's been heavily involved with well-being, but primarily from the children's point of view. So I thought this was a really insightful paper to give us more context and how we can support ourselves and support staff. So bidden in good body, when my private row on row on a whole staff for a school, as my own happiness, my plant and happiness, my own interest clue that, but my my face a sector and given global and whole space to give a divide line planting and probably bank. Fel arweinydd, dwi'n meddwl bod y papur yma'n hynod y bwysig. Mae wedi dod ar yr amser cywir hefyd, achos mae'n, mae'n ddiddorol, achos mae'n sôn am reality sy'n felly yng Nghymru heddi. Mae lles yr holl gymuned ysgol yn bwysig, ond dyn ni ddim yn rhoi amser i flaen o'r eithi lles, penaethiaid a fi'n credu mae'n hynod y bwysig, achos penaethiaid sy'n arwain yr ysgol ac yn creu diwylliant, ac os nad ydy lles arweinwyr mewn lle, yna, yna amlwg dwi'n pawb arall ddim yn mynd i weithredu a cyd weithredu gyda gilydd i symud ysgol yn ei flaen. The relationship started by realising that learning could be transferred from NHS to education and that we were both struggling with similar issues, systemic issues that have a huge impact on our services. Through questionnaires and focus groups, we were able to better make sense of the demands faced by senior leaders, some of which relate to performance, some to the organisation, and others being social or psychological demands that shape the role. Fundamentally, senior leaders share that there are a variety of barriers to thriving in their roles and that there's both a need and desire for a cultural shift. The title More Than a Sticking Plaster came from a questionnaire response by a head teacher and I think it perfectly illustrates the need for more than a reactive approach to what at first glance can appear to be a simple problem. I think it's worth noting that such a multifactorial issue has a range of possible responses and it's important we don't pluck for simplistic solutions that fail to account for the chronic nature of the problem. This will obviously take time and require thinking around prioritisation but I think it's really exciting that there's an opportunity now to use this paper as a launch pad for a considered, evidence-based and longitudinal response which will fundamentally shape what happens next and enhance senior leaders' experience as well as the experience of those in schools more widely. The sharing of learning and resources has been highly fruitful and I think potentially has got a long way to go. Nath ni gomisiwn i'r papur uh, mwy na phlaster gan Dr Ali Davis fel rhan o'n gwaith ni i gefnogi uh, lles arweinwyr y Mang Hymru. Uh, mae'n bwysig yn bod ni gyfalu am dan yn arweinwyr i ni'n ymwybodol iawn bod na sefyllfa o arweinwyr yn gadael y profesiwn ac felly uh, yn dibynnu wrth gomisiwn i'r papur yma ydy edrych ar ffyrdd um, i ddatrys y broblem um, bod ni yn uh, ffeindio hi'n anodd i ddenu arweinwyr uh, mewn i'r proffesiwn ac i gynnal nhw unwaith yn y yma. Felly nawr mae'r papur wedi ei lansio um, i ni'n derbyn adborth gan yn partneriaid a'n uh, rhanddeiliaid i ddysgu am ffyrdd gwahanol o ddablygu'r gwaith yma ymhellach ac rydyn ni um, yn, yn trafod y gwaith yma um, gyda'r partneriaid hynny ar hyn o bryd.